Well, this has been a weird day. Exactly. Hmm, nicely equipped. What needs work? Good morning, brother. No news, I'm afraid. But I have a plan. Do you now? Renards. You found them once. Could you do so again? I could try, but I don't see how that they would help. They are the fates of these lands, are they not? I would know what they know. You may not find them cooperative. As long as I find them, where do we search? Midgard. But if Atreus is in Asgard, there's no getting him back without an army. We should be raising one. Yes, nothing like a catastrophic war to improve the situation. The boy seems quite capable, perhaps if you simply give him some time. You are not free of blame here. You encourage his foolishness. It's confusion. I do not seek war. But if Odin has stolen my son, do not doubt the lengths I will go to. Your nature has always been clear, Kratos. But you, Freya. War is a first resort. That's not the Freya I knew. I hope the Norns can give you the counsel you need. Perhaps mine is no longer of use here. Oh. Tear, stop. This is no time to divide ourselves further. Come, sit, please. You have been quiet. Frankly, I'm surprised you of all people would seek out fate. But your instincts haven't let us down so far. Let's find the norms. Who am I to offer him counsel? I only hoped to help the boy find his answers. And I failed. What's my role in all this now? Tyr, you're at the center of this. You always have been. That's why Odin imprisoned you in the first place. He's terrified of you. <laughs> it's the truth. And not just because of prophecies. No one has ever united the realms as you once did. That is not who I am anymore. I know you feel that way now. But believe me, there is something beyond that. And what is that? Hearing our justice is not 
Does it hurt? Oh, this? Only when I worry. How would a trace get to Asgard? I'm sorry, but you'd have to ask Odin. He's got control of every path. I know how highly you esteem our expertise on such things, so I'm sure that's disappointing. He's just been one step ahead of us. I got something for you. Sindri! Coming! Before you go traipsing off into the dawn, I thought you'd like to have this back. Hmm. Well, don't go getting too cheery about it. But you're welcome. I've collected what we need to find the Norns. Shall we go? I suspect we may have consequences to look forward to. Squirrel. Ah, Master Kratos, my apologies. Madam Nethode's disappearance weighs heavily on my mind. She a friend of yours? Less a friend than another longtime tenant of the tree. She was here even before I arrived, and that was ages ago. To even think something could keep her away from her babies. Terrible, just terrible. certain the trace could not still be in Midgard. I was just there and found no trace. If Odin invited him, he must have provided a way. No. That is not the only explanation. Tell me where we find these Norns. I discovered some of their threads near the frozen lake. I stashed one for spellcrafting, but we may also use it to find them. Just remember, they really don't want to be found. Well, at least things will be difficult for a change. We should take your sled and head to the lake. Midgard. How I've missed the freezing gusts and constant raider attacks. Well, that's because they believe Kratos is responsible for Fimble Winter, and that killing him will end it. Where would they get an idea like that? From me, of course. Of course. Oh. Quiet. She is a friend. No. Better they get this from you. Once the wolves have the scent of the Norns, we'll just need to follow their lead. Mm. I will open the gate. <laughs> Stop whining. Their fur is matted. When did you last brush them? They are wolves. And matted fur leads to disease. 
Take care of them, and they'll take care of you. Brother, what exactly do you intend to ask the Norns? How I may find my son. Not more. You don't imagine it's a chance to clear up all this mess about prophecy? Perhaps get a second opinion on your alleged demise. You didn't tell me you had a death prophecy? When Atreus and I reached Jotunheim, we found a hidden mural. The giants. They herself had foreseen our entire journey long ago. Who we would meet, who we would fight. All of it, as it happened. But you aren't dead. That image was from a time yet to come. I see. You've never struck me as someone who fears death. That's not a problem, is it? No. Death can have me when it earns me. Then maybe it's not the future that bothers you. Faye sent you on your journey, and she made sure you'd see that image at the end of it. And you're still not sure why. I wish to speak of this no further. Now that we are on the lake, how will we find the Norns? Watch the wolves closely. See how their heads point the way? Well, the Lake of Nine has certainly seen better days. The raiders have made themselves quite at home. Not sure I've been back to these parts since our great battle with Secret. She speaks highly of that fight as well. You know of that. She told me all about it when she found me. She believed you could be an ally. Long before I believed it. The Valkyrie Queen. An ally. I'm the Valkyrie Queen. As Sigrun was stubbornly determined to remind me. I should have guessed it was Sigrun helping you recover yourself. She's so loyal and wise. Never. Oh. Enough. We will continue later. Namir, the way you still speak of Sigrun, it doesn't take a love goddess to see where you're coming from. This thread of faith we are tracing. It's not somebody's life, if that's what you mean. The Norns use it to mark their way when they're outside of the well. The Norns live in a well. No. The well of Earth, their home, is hard to explain. It's in no fixed place. Entrances come and go. A place wholly under their influence, where the intangible becomes tangible. Like being inside your own mind. But if we go in together, are we in each other's mind? Not so sure I like the sound of that. <laughs>
More Trogger falling out of the bloody ground. You're on fire, Gleaton. It will pass. gods for the death of her family, and has been haphazardly wreaking her vengeance on anything within arm's reach. Even death didn't stop her. I know. Count of the norms. No. Not personally. <laughs> Faye is right. They have ways of discouraging visitation. Odin <laughs> made his share of efforts. Wouldn't talk about what he found. Either he gave up, or he wanted to forget what he saw. <laughs> Fair. You mind telling us what you experienced when you sought the norms last time? To be honest, the details are hazy like waking up from a dream. Mainly, I remember that nothing could be done to change my son's fate, which only made me more determined to try. Brother, what of your story? You face the fates of your homeland, yeah? Old. The wolves are distracted. Kratos, a raider encampment. Shall we take care of them, brother? What? 
Suspect that's all of them. These were coal raiders. Infamous. Eating wolves. Atreus and I rescued ours from such an encampment. That was kind of you. The coal raiders have been a blight on this land. The way they've abused its creatures. Perhaps we should do something about them. Perhaps. Up to you, brother. If the Norns know the future, no doubt they'll expect us to show up a bit late. Now, brother, what about when you faced the fates of Greece? The legends I heard about the ghost of Sparta were surely exaggerated. Exaggerated? Oh, not in the brazen bloodshed righteous fury part. The part where it said you traveled back in time itself to win a battle once lost. It's strange credulity, obviously. I mean, a rumor about Thor knocking the world serpent back in history from Ragnarok is one thing. It is the truth. The threads of fate span all life and time. The sisters of fate abused their power. When I challenged them, they threatened to undo my existence. So I killed them and turned their power on Zeus. I scouted ahead. The, the lake is crawling with raiders. Thing I've Be ever careful. Heard. Whatever these you need, I'll have create. no such magic. Nor does anyone in these realms that I've ever seen. I can you imagine? If it existed, Odin would have it. And if Odin had it, we'd be five shades more fucked than we are already. I would not ask them to change the past, even if they could. 
I only want information. And that's quite dangerous enough, in my experience. I am, as always, at your service. survived a giant's corpse to a stop a certain fight we won't talk about. Could you call on that power again? Maybe. Do you have a massive giant's corpse for me to revive? Uh, no. Well, there you go. All those norns aren't going to find themselves. Back to the wolves. <laughs> Fire! <laughs> 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 
Danger. Uh, the wolves fear that which can no longer hurt them. The horrors of our past can be inextricable from the present. You have to understand that. I'm all for exploring the area, but to be clear, it's down there we'll find the Norns. What's that outpost? I've been studying, and I can forge some new equipment for you. What can I make for you? Well, if you change your mind... You won't believe it, Lumir. This crest belongs to Fjotrlund. Fjotrlund, you say? Now that's where Sigrun was from. Another crane. Another sleeping beast, the handiwork of Alvi Stonefoot. Outpost is what's left of Fjortelun. Sigrun started going up with these people before she joined the group. Ugh. 
No, brother. Sigrun told me her kingdom housed a great treasury filled with the spoils of her family's conquests. Perhaps this outpost holds some of that treasure. Is that all she told you, Mimir? Did she say where? No, just that they kept it hidden. Well done. Perhaps those runes over there can shed some light. What? No. 
she never mentioned. Is that a key? Hmm. Wonder what lock that key belongs to. No lock. It is broken. Not broken. It's just split in half. Perhaps we could find its partner. musical instrument from your homeland, isn't it? Can you play? Yes. Will you? No.
Namir, what did those runes say? Secret. She loved another. A king named Helgi. Seems they were madly in love. But her parents wouldn't let them marry. Oh, come, Namir. You really didn't think you were her first love, did you? Aye. I suppose I did. Brother, in my travels, I heard of a great battle in your homeland, at a place called the Gates of Fire. The Hard Gates. You are there? No. Is that regret in your past? I did regret not dying there for many years, but no longer. I've never seen that building before. Aye, very strange indeed. Let's take a closer look. Raider on the left! Behind you! Exactly like the one from Tyr's statue. Brother, your fight with Thor must have scattered pieces of Tyr's statue all over the lake. Looks like the shield ended up lodged here. All this must have been hidden behind the ice until that shield smashed through it.
Over there. useful. Whoa! 
Well done. <laughs> Not intentional. Oh, sure. My arrows can't go through walls, I'm afraid. Together again, Mimir. Does this look like an abandoned treasury to you? Aye, ah, it does. Sigrid's family crest. Looks like a vault door to me. That key we found in another part of Sigrun's kingdom. Think it'll unlock it? Not when it's broken in two. Then let us find the other half.